Hi, I'm Nancy Friendsley. I'm the training manager at Berkeley Humane, and we're going to be doing a couple of things today uh, that are fun for your dog. Teach your dog to love going to a matter platform and what things you can do with your fitness ball and that's also fit for your dog. So the first thing we're going to do is get your dog to love a mat. This is just one step in a long process of various things you can do with the batter platform. So I'm gonna put my platform down. As you can see, Popo loves this platform, okay? But I'm gonna to toss a treat off of it. And when she comes back on, good girl, there you go. Oh, there it goes. She gets back on it, good. She gets another one. She gets back on the platform. Good girl, there you go, okay. So we're going to work on having a long down on that matter platform once your dog loves it. And my dog Solo is gonna show you, she likes her mat and her platform equally. So either one you train is really okay. She's gonna get off the platform and she's gonna come right back on it, okay? She gets off, come on. This time we're going to put down the mat. It's just a simple bath mat. Good. All right. She loves getting on that mat. If I get it up and move it, she's going to return to that mat. Good job. There you go. So she really, really likes both the mat and the platform. I like using the platform, so I'm going to use it for our downstay. Okay. So once I have my dog coming back onto the platform and really loving it, I'm going to get it down every time. Then do that down. Good, give her a treat there. And I'm going to start getting a stay. I'm gonna give her a stay, step away a little bit, wait, come back, give her another treat, stay. And I'm gonna to get to where I can walk all the way around this platform, okay? And that way, she's still staying. Every time I give her a treat, this is important, I say stay and Move again. I'm going to turn my back on her. Good. She's doing really well. So this will give you a really, really good solid downstay on a mat, which is a very handy thing to have when you're working at home. You have things you need to do and you need to, your dog to just settle someplace. So if you have a fitness ball at home, you can do a fitness exercise for your dog too. Popo is learning to roll the ball. And the first thing I want to do is get her feet up. Good, I'll use the same process I used to get the, the mat going. Paws up, good, okay. Your first step will be hard. It'll be getting your dog's paws up. And if, oh, there you go. And if you have a smaller dog, you need a smaller ball. So here you go, come up. Oh, you got a couple of steps there. So I'm gonna treat that every time I get a tiny little bit of progress. Yes, good girl. I'm gonna give it a treat. I want one foot after the other moving. Oh, good girl, there you go. All right, here we go. Up you go. Always tell your dog they're really good when they're doing stuff like that for you and they'll have fun getting fit and you'll have fun getting fit with them. So, you want more tips and resources? Go to berkeleyhumane.org.